All sorts of effort with nothing to show for it. Crews worked hard to get a dead baby humpback whale off the reef today at Kuhuku Point. But as KITV4's Andrew Pereira shows us, hopes of bringing that dead animal back to shore vanished at sea. We'll never know if this was a wave goodbye to the dead whale that washed ashore at Kahuku Point, but it's nice to think so. We've just watched some uh, whales breaching out there, you know, hanging around this neighborhood. Who knows if it was their parents or not. This 13-foot-long male calf was spotted by a fisherman early Tuesday morning. It's going to pass it by, maybe not. NOAA, DLNR, and city lifeguards were on hand by 8 o'clock. Belly button is still unhealed from the birth. Um, a very, very young animal. This is the fifth dead baby humpback whale to wash ashore in Hawaii since the start of the year. And that's why researchers want to get this animal to HPU for further study. There would be tissue samples collected, uh, analysis run um, to look for certain specific diseases that may uh, pose a great impact to the population. Devising a game plan to remove the one to two ton marine mammal off the Sharp Reef was tricky enough. But a dead whale in the water is like catnip for sharks. Yeah, Ocean Safety has been out um, warning um, scuba divers and snorkelers to uh, stay out of the area. Um, they're also working on a plan for helping us to secure the whale. At 2.15 in the afternoon, success. The carcass was towed out to sea en route to Haleiwa Small Boat Harbor. But with a dead baby whale trolling the water, tiger sharks took full advantage. DLNR conservation officers were forced to cut the animal loose four miles out to sea off Waimea Bay. You know, it's very unfortunate. Um, it is part of nature. It does happen. Andrew Pereira, KITV4 News. Now, some tissue samples were taken and they will be analyzed at a lab. The good news is that two of the four previous baby whales that washed ashore tested negative for any harmful diseases.